Hello everyone. Today we are going to work on how to equip and unequip the shield. And it's all already working with replication. So if I press one, as you can see, now the character equip both sword and the shield like this. And we can do attacks as well. Those parts we have already worked on. So if I press zero, character put back the shield and the sword is back in sheet so yeah so the big screen is uh, server now let's try this with the client yeah it works same as the server and as you can see everything is properly replicated okay so this is what we are going to work on today and before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done from the patreon page link would be in the description below and you can watch the full tutorial series of this project this is only one episode but everything is accessible for you for free in the in my channel i'll leave the link in description below there you can watch from scratch how did I work on all those mechanisms that you see in this tutorial all right now let's see how to implement equip and unequip sword and shield okay so first uh, let me open my character blueprint and here now I have this weapon blueprint and when I collect the weapon I set the weapon blueprint like this but I also need uh, some variable to store the shield as well so I'll rename this as weapon L because this goes for the left hand sorry this is right hand weapon R the sword will be right hand and then another variable weapon L I'll put it next to this and then here sword is saved into the weapon R shield I'll save into weapon L okay now I have already set up this ability equip and unequip yeah this g gameplay ability ga ga unequip is here and ga equip sword is here so i don't think i want to do any changes to these for now so i will bind uh, do the changes to this equip weapon function itself if i already have a left weapon i'll just equip it because that's how usually it works in games when I equip the sword if I already have a shield the shield also will be equipped so get weapon L if we have a valid reference here I'll attach it to my right hand get a reference to the mesh attach component to component so good name is hand L because it goes to the left hand shape and just like here snap to target everything scale keep relative Mesh is the parent, weapon is the target. Oh, sorry, I should have used attach actor to component. And uh, location, snap to target, rotation, snap to target scale keep relative and same way 
when I am going to unequip just like here I'll do the same thing but for the shield so first we need to check if we have a valid left weapon that would mean shield and even if we don't have we need to continue the execution so connect it like this now the socket that we are going to attach is not the sword shield because shield should go back of the character so uh, my socket name is socket back all right that's actually all let's test equipped equipped now oh i didn't equip the shield why Ah, oh, this is the reason here yeah, I haven't connected this so my bad let me make it like this so it's clear okay now it should work let's test with server first yeah now i have the sword in my left hand if i press zero both are now in my back okay now let's test with a client yeah for the client also it's working all right all good so thanks for watching Next time let's work on how to actually use the shield and block attacks and how characters react to that also. So yeah, updated project files will be available in the Patreon page. Link would be in the description below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.